Oh, hi guys. I'm sorry, just give me one second here. I'm having some technical difficulties, but I hope I can I can fix them. So hold on. Hold on, just give me a moment. Already, can you hear me? Yes. Hello, hello. Can hear you. Yes, very well. Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes, teacher. Great, great. Thank you so much for that. Hello, guys. <laughs> so, hello, good evening. Thank you so much for joining. Uh, I'm sorry about that. I was having some technical difficulties here, but I guess um, they have been uh, solved, right? Um, how are you guys? How are you doing? Is everything okay? Are you doing fine? Are you having a good one? Did you have a nice weekend? Fine. Yes, of um, course. No. <laughs> no, why not? I don't do anything. <laughs> oh, so you had a nice weekend. <laughs> so it means uh, that you rested a lot, I believe. So that, that is just like pretty, pretty nice. Okay, give me one second. Okay, there we go, there we go. All right, guys, so uh, let me see. I got Christian, I got Adolfo, Gabby, I saw you super early. So thank you so much for joining. Judy, good evening. Uh, Helen, great to see you here. Me imagino que está trabajando eh, still, right? But it is super appreciated um, that you are here, that you are joining us today, and that you're ready for classes. Eh, guys, nos faltan oficialmente una semana, so we are missing exactly like five more sessions eh, to finish this module. So we're going to finish today unit number three, right? The one that we are working with branding. Uh, vamos a trabajar un poquito en el, el material que tenemos, en the material, a little bit with reading, and a little bit with cognitive too. Um, antes de iniciar, guys, before getting started with everything, uh, ¿tienen alguna pregunta? Do you have any question? Do you have any doubt? Hay algo de la plataforma que les haya quedado pendiente? You're not sure? No, all is okay for me. Okay, very nice. ¿Ya completamos nice. la tres? Did you complete number three? Yeah. Okay, what about the rest, guys? Did you finish number three or are you still having difficulties with number three? Christian, ¿cómo va con la plataforma? How, um... uh, I finished all. Oh my God, congratulations. I Super good job. All. Okay. Nice, nice. Todo bien, everything good. Um, yes. Um, I remember uh, only question uh, I don't, uh, I, I could uh, respond. Okay. Um, but if you have the picture for that one, I share it, right? And we can we can work on it. So we can definitely check it for you. Already. Um, mm -mm. Okay, girls. What about you, Judy? Good evening, um, Gabby. How you doing, Helen? ¿Qué tal, chicas? ¿Cómo están? Women Power. Hi, so you're the representative today. <laughs> How are you, Miss? Everything good? Uh -huh. I had a good weekend. Oh, you had a good weekend. Amazing. Sounds really good to me. Really nice. What did you do? Um, 
Did you go out? Did you rest a little? Sorry? Uh, yes, what did you do? ¿Qué hizo, Miss? Why? Was it a good weekend? Did you rest? Did you go out? Did you watch a movie? What did you do? Hi, Angelica. Good evening. Siento, teacher. Está inestable la red. Sí, así la escucho. La escucho un poquito como cortadita, but eh, sigue lloviendo. Is it still raining, Julie? Mm, creo que se la está cortando un poco. I think it's breaking a little bit. Sí, está inestable. Okay. Okay, so I guess it is kind of breaking just a little. Um, Angelica, are you with us? Yes, teacher. Hello, miss. How are you? Yeah, a little tired, but fine. Oh, okay. Okay, sounds nice. Sounds quite good. Uh, I'm going to leave that one. Okay. So, tired because of work? Or tired because of something else. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. It was no, a... I mean, probably you, I don't know, you rested a lot or you went, you did exercise, you went running or something. No. No, no. Just for work. Okay. Today, so. <laughs> Mondays are difficult for you? Yes. Mm, okay. And it's Monday. <laughs> so it's the beginning of the week. But I know the feeling. I totally get that. And I shared that as well. <laughs> okay. Okay, guys. Imelda, good evening. Thank you so much for joining. Well, guys, uh, we're going to get started today. Vamos a hablar un poquito like of some random topic to get started with this. Para que comencemos a generar un poquito de idea de conversación, right? And today I brought for you kind of a controversial topic. Uh, I don't know if you are in, I don't know if you are out, I don't know if you shared, you know, this idea. Mm. But this is in regards to plastic surgery. Mm. So uh, probably we have heard like some countries or some culture, everybody needs to get a plastic surgery. And uh, I got a couple of questions for you. So the first one says, what do you think of plastic surgery? Is it necessary? Do you agree? Would you like to get one? What is the most common surgery in your country? Do you know of any plastic surgery that people normally do here? And what celebrities do you know of that have gotten plastic surgery? Uh, so guys, let me listen to you. What do you think? First of all, um, agreement or in disagreement? Are you in agreement or in disagreement? with plastic surgery? Um, in, for me, um, mm -hmm. I think uh, sometimes is necessary. Mm -hmm. um, but, but most of time, yeah, I think is only for mm -hmm. Uh, I think. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, you, you were cut, cut off a little bit. So you said that sometimes it is necessary. Uh, but uh, the, the most time I mm -hmm. think uh, the plastic surgery is only for vanity. Oh, vanity. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. Okay. Interesting. Guys, what are your thoughts here? Do you share the same idea Kristen mentions? Do you think that uh, it is not always necessary, but it is just more like a vanity thing? Like something, I don't know, you want to look pretty, you want to look better. What do you think? Or is it necessary? In Go case ahead. of, in case no. of, in case of uh, emergency, Mm -hmm. um, after an accident, for example, a crash, and mm -hmm. maybe you need some surgery, but mm -hmm. uh, to improve the handsome or pretty, mm -hmm. uh, I, I'm not agree. Mm -hmm. So yeah. you're not, for example, if I say, oh, I'm too fat, I'm going to get the, uh, oh my God, 
I forgot in the name. <laughs> I'm gonna get like a surgery to reduce my my tummy, for example. Or yeah. oh, I don't like my nose. I'm gonna get a, rhino, a rhinoplasty here. So um, you don't agree for those for that kind of purposes? Yeah, because uh, we have to be original, real, a real person. I think so. Okay, interesting. Yeah. Guys, girls. <laughs> girls. Boys. What do you think on this? Well, in in my opinion, I am. Totally agree if oh, interesting. Uh, the person is um, an adult and okay. if can make the decision without a uh, um, uh, pressure, pressure, pressure. Uh -huh. uh, without a uh, uh, pressure of the, the couple, of the uh, friends or, or any kind of pressure because um i am agree if there is a if the... hello imelda i think we lost imelda right yes yeah i could okay so she mentioned that if you are an adult and uh, if you can make a decision with no pressure, like on your own decision, so she yes. was negative with that. Oh, I met you, Elda, you're back. Okay, sorry, I think we, we lost you for a moment. Okay. Uh, so, so you agree in that in that scenario? Yes, when, when it's a, a personal decision without mm -hmm. a pressure, because I believe in um, corporal autonomy. I don't know if that is correct. Corporal autonomy. What okay. do you mean corporal? by that? Yes, Autonomia what do you mean corporal? by that? <laughs> <laughs> but what is that? <laughs> it, it's, it's, it's her body. It's when, like your body, your you decision. Can, yeah, yes, your when body, you your can decision. decide about what do you do with your body. Mm, oh, interesting. Wow. Even, uh, uh -huh. Uh, well, I, I I agree totally. Well oh, tell us. You were going to say something else. Say it. Yeah. <laughs> this guy. If you want, <laughs> if, you, if you want, and um, if you have money, go ahead. Uh, okay. If, if, okay. If, if, if it's your body, your decision. That's my okay. my okay. belief. <laughs> Sounds cool. Sounds really interesting to hear. Okay. Nice. So, guys, what about the rest of you? What do you think? Are you in agreement with this? Are you in disagreement? What are your thoughts? I super like Imelda's opinion because at the end of the day, um, yeah, if you get the money, if you have the resources, um, who are the rest of us to criticize, right? So, okay, okay. Anybody else? Well, I respect that that opinion, but I think oh, I like this. Uh huh. Is a surgery is implies some risk okay. always, okay. always. Oh, if not, if it's not necessary, I don't, I don't agree with with the surgery plastic. So it has to be like extremely necessary. Yes. But oh. I respect to the actors or so uh, imagine public they mm -hmm. need, but that's, that, that's their work. Mm -hmm. So not for everybody. Not for everybody. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Well, really interesting. In, in my case, I I agree with um, Angelica. For example, in my personal life. I think I could I couldn't do an an surgery because um in my case I think it is not worth the risk like Angelica mm -hmm. says mm -hmm. um I think that uh, and I think there are many doctors that mm -hmm. uh, maybe they they can promise something that is not real or, or, the, or they don't explain, they, they doesn't explain very well the risk mm -hmm. uh, to, the, to the client. Mm -hmm. And I think that is important. Uh, if you decide to do it um, a surgery, you mm -hmm. have to um, investigate. <laughs> investigate your research. Uh -huh. Yes, about all the risk 
Oh, very nice. Okay, interesting. So we're having a debate here. Anybody else? Does anybody say no? I completely disagree with this. No, probably not. <laughs> okay. Mm, I'm, I, I am. I'm agree. If okay. a person understands the risk, mm -hmm. well, uh, is free to do whatever with with her or his body. Mm, okay. Okay. Interesting. So your body, your decision. Okay. Okay. Cool. Sounds really nice. Guys, uh, in, in our country, do you think this is common? Is it normal for everybody to get a surgery? I think no, it's not uh, it's, uh, uh, rare. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, listen mm -hmm. about a person with uh, plastic surgery. Okay, okay. Hi, Margarita, Daniel, welcome, guys. Good evening. Hello. Andrea, great to see you. I'm doing great. Tell me, hello. Carlos, hey there. Good evening. Hi, Arnoldo. Good evening. How are, how are you doing? I'm fine. Thank you. Nice to hear that. So, guys, we are discussing what about a little you? bit. Uh, I'm doing great, but for some reason, Mondays or this like Monday feel so tiring. So yes, wow. but I guess it's just the beginning of the of the week, right? <laughs> okay. So uh, me, I I have a, a, a commentary about the ah the perfect. Topic. Yes, go ahead. <laughs> Be my in, guest. In my case, I have um most no okay more or ten plastic surgery. Uh, in my, in my, in my, yes, in because I'm born with this, this part of my body, mm -hmm. uh, separate. Okay. It's called in, in, in español labio leporino. Oh, are you mm -hmm. serious? Yeah, yeah, this, this place, I have a scar, cicatriz. But it is not, no, the thing is that it is not noticeable. So yeah. if you don't tell us, we will never know. <laughs> yes. I, I mean, because, it's, it's not something I, noticeable. My, my, my nose is uh, some wrong. <laughs> my nose is un poco de viada. Ah, because, okay. Because, because I'm born with a labio leporino and paladar en vivo. Ah, and okay. in the hospital, hospital room, okay. I, I pass, um, to a, um, 15, no, 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 um, how say, 15 years okay. in, 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 15 years in control. Oh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. okay. I, I, Did you I, get a I, surgery? Yes, 10, more, uh, 12, 10 or 12 surgery. <laughs> wow. Is, 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 is it close, is close <laughs> my... My, my, my upper lip. <coughs> yes, my, my labio de arriba. My upper lip. My upper lip, yes. Yes, yes. close my upper lip and the all the, the, the paladar, the part of the arriba. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. yes. Oh, okay. The last, the, so the, the last, the lip. Okay. Yes, the last, the last surgery was in about um, 30 years ago. Oh. 30 years yeah, yeah. ago. 30 years ago, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, wow. Okay. Because I, I, the experience. I, I, yes, in my, in, my, in my personal case, I don't like it. Wow. I, 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 I guess. Yeah, 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 because I, uh, every year, every month, uh, Every month of my young, I mean, I mean, I mean of my children, my mm -hmm. your I mean, childhood, yes, my chi childhood, yes, it brings bad remember. memories. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry yeah, to yeah. hear that, but <laughs> but I, I'm super happy that you overcame that. You know that you went. I know that the process must be really painful, but yeah. but to be honest, it is not noticeable. So, if okay. no nos dice, we will never know. Wow. So, yeah, yeah. 10 yeah. surgeries. Yeah. That's yeah. a lot. 
the last, the last, in the last surgery, I practically was ciego, practically. Wow, so well, there was because, a big risk. Yes, big risk because this was my first surgery in Hospital Rosales. Oh, and the rest and of the other, in bloom. Yes, yes. Oh, okay. I, I think it's because the, the anesthesia, 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 anesthesia. anesthesia it mm -hmm. was more strong, I don't know. Probably, it was mm -hmm. stronger mm -hmm. than needed, mm -hmm. probably, mm -hmm. but, exactly. but I'm glad, but you're okay, mm -hmm. are you fine? Yeah, 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 okay, yeah. I, I use glass for the age. <laughs> Ah. Oh, okay. Not, not because of the surgery. <laughs> no, not because of the oh. surgery, no, no. Okay. I mean, I wear I, glasses, but <laughs> yeah. I, I wear know. I wear glass uh, five years ago. Oh, no, no, no. So recently. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. I have been wearing glasses for over seven years, I think. But yeah, I got you. Okay. Mm -hmm. But but if you had the chance, for example, to get a surgery in your eyes, would you do it? In my eyes, uh, uh -huh. in my, um, in my, mm, no, no, it's very, but with, at first I don't have money. <laughs> no, no, but if you it's have a chance, uh -huh, but if you had the um, chance to say, oh, I, I don't want to wear glasses anymore, I got the money, so uh, would I, you get I, the surgery? I, I only, I only use the glasses for real and, and see the, the, the cell phone. If, oh. if I if I don't if I don't use glass, I see the cell phone this, like this. I go I go I don't <laughs> so see. So you need like okay. Yeah yeah okay. I don't see I don't see norm in a in a normal distancia. Mm -hmm. Because yeah, I, from I, far away. Uh -huh. Yeah yeah I I need uh, to do this. If I it's uh, only the glasses is for the for real for, ah, for real okay. read a book read a paper. Or, or, or see when when I I pass a long time mm -hmm. in the cell phone, uh, my, uh -huh. my 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 vista se cansa, it's tired. Yes, so it yeah. gets tired. It's normal. It's oh, normal. okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, but I guess. For, but for dry, for talking about for talking in my daily routine, I don't use glass. Oh, okay. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Sounds really mm -hmm. nice. Okay. <laughs> but 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 yeah. now that you have told us about your personal experience, um, what are your thoughts or what are your recommendations? Um, because now you have like the experience to talk about it, to give us your personal idea on this. Um, yeah, so do you think it is necessary? And in my case, uh, the the surgery the, the the surgery was necessary mm -hmm. because uh, I, I I need to to look normal. No, but you uh, look normal. <laughs> Do yeah, it, uh, you. but I get you. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah, but uh, but if if you you but if you if you make if you need to make a, a plastic surgery. Only for I don't know look better um, or for more young. You wouldn't recommend it. For, for, no, I don't recommend it. Okay. It's normal. Okay. It's, uh, it, Thank it, you so much. Case, yeah, in the days uh, the, the the people say is uh, uh, medicine to tell to me. Mm -hmm. uh, they tell cubrete, me. Cubrete las canas, o sea, ah, why? to to dye your hair. Yeah, yeah, o sea, me dicen, cubriste las canas que se te miran, y dije, ¿por qué? Pues, o sea, I am old, estoy viejo. <laughs> okay. It's normal. Okay. So you get to look natural, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Guys, what about the rest of you? So, um, is there, like, any surgery that, that you think, I mean, not talking about, like, medical purposes or necessary purposes, um, do you think it is, like, is there any surgery that you would like to try? Carlos? Margarita? <laughs> Guys, is there any surgery you would like to have or to get? No, thank you. Some surgery. No? Um, in my case, no. I don't um, want any surgery. Uh, okay. 
not even for medical purposes, so you wouldn't? Um, if, if, if it's the case is about a, a medical cause, uh, maybe. Okay, you would accept that, okay. Okay, sounds all right. No, thank you, says Angelica. <laughs> in my case, I got one in my hand. Why? What happened? Because I, to uh, you? I was uh, have a uh, quiste senovial, se llama. Quiste senovial. It's a small ah, surgery. It's like a small in, ball, right? Uh -huh. But uh -huh. uh, in my case, it's up there. But does it hurt? Uh, yeah, in, in the moment, uh -huh. no, because of the anesthesia. But uh, mm -hmm. after eight hours, it's horrible pain. Do you have to put anesthesia every day on it? Local. Are you serious? Every yeah, local only. I, I, I've been watching when they been making me the surgery. Oh, in, but, in but fact, wait. The doctor, the doctor made a mistake and he cut a arteria. Wow. I, I saw suddenly the, the blood, the floating. The, my blood jumping out of my head. Wow. Yeah, yeah, but for a little moment. Mm -hmm. But they can handle it, so they know what uh -huh, to do, right? But the pain is horrible. Oh. Because. Wow, that, that is terrible. I mean, every day getting anesthesia. Yeah. It's, uh, they only gave me two or three days of mm -hmm. uh, uh, rest, uh -huh. medical leave, medical uh -huh. leave, doctor's correct. leave. Correct. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right. Oh, three days of doctor's leave mm -hmm. and then mm -hmm. by ese trabajar. Yeah, <laughs> with oh. a férula. Oh, do you wear it? No. Uh, oh, not, almost 15 days. Oh. I, I've been wearing a ferula. Oh, okay. Okay, interesting. Wow, That's but as I think somebody said, there is a big risk, aunque sea pequeña, right? So there is always like a big yeah. risk that something uh, may go wrong. Yeah, um, <laughs> the, the doctor never accepted. He made a mistake when he cut the arteria. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but what the good thing is that you're fine, you're uh, good, and yeah, yeah. thank God. Uh, so, thank you. Thank God that was it. Uh -huh. So yeah. there was not like any bigger consequence. Yeah. I think I heard Imelda. Imelda, tell us. Um, no, just I just want to share um, a comment about mm -hmm. the, the, the question, the, what is the most common plastic surgery in the oh, country? Okay, okay. Uh, well, I don't know what is the most common, but um, I think uh, maybe if you are not in, in the media, you can think it's not common, but for example, uh, the, who working in a, in a media, in television or a, a, like, maybe as a model or something like that is very common mm -hmm. because for example um, the last uh, the previous um, um, uh, so those are called patron celebrations patron celebrations patron celebration mm -hmm. of the city san salvador city mm -hmm. uh, i was in the the contest of me san salvador and okay. the, the principal, the, the main. What were you doing there? <laughs> Did you go as a, a, I mean, just to observe or, I don't know. You don't look like the kind of person who goes to contest. Hello. 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 I, I, can, I... can you hear me? Can you hear me now? Yes. Yes. Oh, okay. I was asking you, what were you doing in the contest? <laughs> because you don't look my... like the person. No, who likes to I go don't to know. <laughs> I, I, I am not. Uh -huh. but my my nephew, it was a candidate to Miss El Salvador. <laughs> my, oh, my, my niece. Your sorry, niece? My niece. Ah, okay. My niece, okay. Yes, my oh, niece. nice. Yes, she was. Did she a, win? 
No, she doesn't. She didn't. Yeah, okay, okay. <laughs> but este, uh, she invite invite me to to go to oh. uh, look look at the contest. So you were supporting and, her. Yes, and, and the 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 funny it was um she she told me that mm -hmm. many of the candidates it was mm -hmm. operated by oh. the the judge by the judge that it was a. Uh, um, a plastic surgery or it was a plastic surgeon sorry no voy a repetir había un juez que era cirujano plástico there was a surgeon uh -huh. <laughs> entonces este muchas de las participantes habían sido operadas por él <laughs> no seriously <laughs> sí <laughs> Oh. Because of that, I think it's most common that we think. Mm -hmm. oh. But, uh -huh. oh, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yes, it is like really interesting because normally that wouldn't be, I think that shouldn't be permitted, right? That shouldn't be allowed, but okay. But, okay. yes. <laughs> Wow, that is really interesting. Thank you for sharing that story. I, I, uh -huh. I it caught my attention because you don't look like the kind of person who is no, festivities, you know, contesting all those things. Okay, thank you so much for sharing that. All right, guys, uh, thank you for your opinions. I am missing a couple of voices. Algunos están un poco callados today. <laughs> but hopefully you, we can listen to your voices in a little while. Um, guys, today we are going to move on with unit number three. Vamos a practicar un poquitito like some questions that we have a pending y también un poquito de los causative that I guess some of you were having some uh, questions on, especialmente con la parte de make, let, y vamos a agregar uno más que es um, help, right? Uh, allow me just a second. Let me share this. Where is the Okay, this is the book. So, mm -mm. guys, if you are in your book, uh, if you have it open and, and if you want to take it as a reference, uh, oh, wait, hold on. Okay. So, this is your material, and we are in Unit 3. This is page number 27. So, in page number 27, we have a little conversation. Um, and they are talking about different like brand components, national brands, and uh, expectations that we have about these brands. So uh, we practiced this conversation in the previous uh, class, right? If you remember this part. And for example, we had this expression that is make you float like a feather. So recuerden que es a feather, guys. Do you remember the meaning of feather? Uh, pluma. Mm -hmm. Very good. There we go. What about this one? It says, I think I will buy a pair, of, a pair to see what all the fuss is about. What is this expression? All the fuss. All the fuss. Mm -hmm. um, At the bottom. I don't know. All I don't know. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, so fuss. people, uh, yes. Um, for example, right now, Everybody is making fuss, right, about the costillas. Guys, have you seen meme? Have you seen the meme? About the costillas? Uh, yes. No, no. So people are making a fuss. Is it trending now? I don't know, yes, but I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there is. I'm going to write it this way. So remember that making a fuss is like hacer un desorden or... The Darle demasiada atención a algo. So yeah. everybody's talking about that. So that is making a fuss, right? Okay. Yeah, and that fast. is the expression. Mm -hmm. So okay. that was in page number 27, right? But we're going to move on a little bit. And we have um, still a couple of exercises here to work on. So uh, we also, in the previous class, we completed the exercises with make and get. And we were having this um, contrast between make, que es una, como una obligación, right? My, my mom made me clean, she made me color, she made me, um, I don't know, uh, be on top of my class, whatever. And get es un poco más flexible, it's a little bit uh, softer, and it is not a mandatory situation. Uh, 
in not, general, right? Not, not should. Mm, it's super flexible. That is the point we get. That is super, super flexible. Okay. Um, but today, guys, we are going to practice two more causatives. So they are help and they are let. So we have make, we have get, we have help, and we have let. ¿Por qué se llama causative? Oh, easy. Uh, because normally, van acompañados, and they are talking about something that is cost, right? So um, take a look at this little conversation. It says, Angela and Matthew are discussing about basic ideas to start developing a brand. So let's read the conversation. Let me read it for you, okay? And then guys, I would like to uh, have you read it as well. It says, I went into business as a lawyer six months ago, but I barely get any customer. I help people find the best way out of legal trouble for a cheap price, but they seem to prefer the competition. Probably you need to define the brand of the service you are providing to improve the business. How do I do that? I just usually let customers do some promotion for me with business cards. Your clients can help you to can help you. Um, oh. Yes, but, yeah, I'm, but, but I'm sorry. I just got to, before we move on, there is a mistake here. Uh, help, no necesita do. Sorry about that. Your clients can help you do all the advertising. You already decided what kind of low you focus on. Now, you have to focus on the kind of clients you want to work with and define the brand you want. So, guys, we are going to practice this little conversation. It's super short, I would say. But guys, antes de, de, de iniciar, repiten conmigo, please. Let, just repeat with me. Um, mm, mm, okay, let's start with this one. This is as a, as a. As a. Asa. Asa. Fibrenlo un poquito más. Asa. 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 As a lawyer. And in business, as a lawyer. Asa. Asa. As a lawyer. Asa. Yes. This one se vibra siempre. Creo que escuché la voz de Rafa. Hi, Rafa. No. Hi, good evening. Okay. Ya no veo la cámara, but I listen to your voice. You know? Okay. Next one, guys. Let's go with this one. Uh, trouble. 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 There we go. Oh, oh. And this word oh, that is super interesting. Burly. 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 There we go. Okay. Um, let me just take a look here. There was something else. Okay. And if you remember, tenemos linking también. So siempre vamos a unir algunos sonidos. So we don't say focus on, but we say focus on. 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 Super suave, guys. Focus. Okay. Focus. Focus on. Focus on. No, le agregamos una I. So be careful with that. So focus on. All right. Now you have to focus on the kind of clients you want to work with. Okay. Next one. Vamos a trabajar con esta. Work with. Work with. Work, work with. with, work with, work, work with. with. Nice, work with. Uh huh. Work, work with. And I would say those are the most difficult words. Guys, ven otra palabra que puede ser difícil for you or any other word that you're having difficulties with? Okay. Solo se me olvidaba una más acá, que es esta pequeña combinación que tenemos. Way out on. So I'm not going to read it away. So I'm not going to say I help people find the best way out of, actually, no. So we simply say the best way out of, the best way out of. So with me, way out of. Way out of. Way out of. Way out of. So, so, esa OF suena como una uv, como una v, right? So, way, way, ow, way, ow, something like that. Way, ow, way, ow, no way. Eso se ve raro. Way, 
out of. Yeah, something like that. So way out of. Mm -hmm. So the best way out of. The best way out of. The best way way out out out. This is like a o u. I don't know something like this. So you better find a way to to say it. But um, this is pretty much, guys. What we are gonna practice. Remember, no leemos um, flat. Intentemos leerlo. Intentemos buscar una palabra importante en Subimos un poquito la voz, right? Um, for example, en la oración número uno puedo seleccionar cualquier palabra, pero voy a subir un poquito la voz en esa palabra. Imagine that is a lawyer. So, I went into business as a lawyer six months ago. Y luego bajo nuevamente. Eso me va a dar ritmo y me va a hacer sonar diferente, all right? So, guys, vamos a practicarlas en pareja. We're going to practice this in peers. Practiquenla todas las veces que sea necesario, especialmente los sonidos que nos cuesten más, que pueden ser los linking sounds. Eh, si tienen dudas, or if you're having trouble pronouncing some words, let me know, o está el botoncito del question mark y me invitan, right? Con gusto les llevo por ahí, guys. So, practiquemos todo lo que podamos. Please, practice as much as possible. Uh, we have five minutes, and then we'll have some volunteers. Let's go, 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 go.
Thank you guys for coming back. So thanks a lot uh, for coming back, guys. Let's go ahead and practice uh, this part that we have right here. And uh, we have this little conversation. First of all, and before getting started, um, ¿hay alguna palabra que se les haya hecho un poco difícil? Is there any word that you are still hesitant, que no estamos muy seguros? Uh, what is the best way to pronounce it? Barely means... Barely. 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 Okay, burly. thanks. Mm -hmm. Uh, for me, it's way, way off. Way, way, way out? Way out of. Um, way out of. Uh -huh. But out. just way a little recommendation here. La OF, this little one. Give me one second. Um, wait, 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 wait. Okay. So we have this one and we have this one. Se parece mucho, but the pronunciation changes a little bit. Esta de acá la pronunciamos como of. Oh. And esta de acá la pronunciamos como of. So of Where and of. Exactly. Where yes, perfect. Where that's yes, that's Where the one. Out. So um, we are uh, Christian. I, I, I feel is is a little difficult uh, to Out? say the word uh, mm -hmm. with in, in in inside the entire sentence. Oh, okay, okay. So let's give it a try. Um, so, esta T se convierte en una R. So, it's okay. like way out of, way out of, out of. Way out of, way 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 out of. Solo viviremos un poquito. Yes. Solo vibre un poquito la F. Of. 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 Yes, so la vibramos un poquito because otherwise la podemos confundir with of. So we have of and of. Okay. So the best way out of, out of. Way out of. The best way out of. Mm -hmm. That's the way. Guys, repitamos esta expresión, please. Uh, I think that it is super difficult at the beginning, pero cuando ustedes ya la agarran, eh, va a ser más fácil, you know, en automático nos vamos. So. Uh, let's just way practice this of. one. Repeat with me, please. Way out of. 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 Solo vibren un poquitito en la of. Way out of. Way out of. Way out of. Way out of. There we go. There we go. Okay, guys. Nice. Volunteers. Do we have any volunteers? Thank you, Carlos. Okay, perfect. Carlos, ¿con quién quiere practicarle? Who do you want to practice with? Veo también a Andre ready. So. Okay, Carlos, ¿quién era su compañero? Who was your partner? Mm -hmm. I've been practicing with Andrea and with ah, okay. Daniel. I don't know. Oh, oh, I, I saw Andrea's hand, so I think that Andrea can help us. Uh, so okay. I don't know which one you want to be. Do you want to be Matthew or if you want to be Angela? I want to start. Oh, okay. Um, Andre, are you ready? You ready, okay. Andrea? Yes, I'm ready. Okay. I went into business as a lawyer six months ago, but I barely get any customer. I help people find the best way out of legal trouble for a cheap price, but they seem to prefer the competition. Probably you need to define the brand of the service you are providing to improve the business. How do I do that? I usually let customers do some promotion for me with business card. Your clients can help you do all the advertising. You already decide what kind of law you focus on. Now you have to focus on the kind of clients you want to work with and define the brand you want. Nice, nice. Sounds really good, guys. Good job. Actually, so bastante fluida. It sounds very fluent, very good pronunciation too. It tiene muy buen sonido, muy buen ritmo, muy buena entonación. Very nice. Okay. Guys, who wants to be the next? I think we can have like two or one more and, and then we move on. Volunteers? Okay, me. Okay. 
Thank you, Adolfo. Who do you want to practice with? I don't know. Eh, ¿Con quién estaba practicando? Who were you practicing with? Uh, with um, Judy. Okay, with Judy. I remember that. Judy, are you with us? Yes. Okay, okay. perfect. I am Matteo. Okay. Okay. I went into business as a lawyer six months ago, but I barely get any customer. I help people find the best way, the best way out of legal trouble for a cheap price, but they seem to prefer the competition. Probably you need to define the brand of the service you are providing to improve the business. How do I do that? I just usually let customers do some promotion for me with business card. Your clients can help you do all the advertising. You already decided what kind of the lab to focus on. Now, you have to focus on the kind of clients you want to work with and define the brand you want. Okay. Very nice. Good job, Judy. That sounds amazing. Very good job, Adolfo, as well. Thank you. Nice. Super cool, guys. Okay, now let's take a look at how we use help and how we use let, right? Uh, for example, the person here says, I help people find the best way out of legal trouble because this person is a lawyer. And I usually let customers do some promotion or uh, your clients can help you do. Something very interesting with help and let is that you never used to. I help people, fine. I let customers do. I help you. Y acá se había un error con el to because help no lleva to. So I can help or I, I can help, or I can help you do, right? So now guys, let's talk a little bit about the things that you help people do. So whenever we are using help, um, we use like this, help someone, right? And then one bird, because this is what we do. So I help people, Guys, what do you do? ¿A qué les ayudan a las personas? Like in a very general way. What about your, your piece of, I don't know, of extra? Or what do you normally do with customers or in your company? So in my case, for example, I think that I help people um, follow uh, their dreams because I think that English is amazing. It opens a lot of opportunities, a lot of doors. And most of them require another language. So I think I help people follow their dreams. So, but if you take a look, uh, this someone, siempre necesitamos decir quién, right? I help my brother, I help my mom, I help my sister. So I help somebody. In the case of let, it is exactly the same. So I can use let, but the difference is that help imp implies help. And let implies Something that you allow, right? So, guys, ¿qué, ¿qué permiten que los demás hagan? So, again, we are going to use I let someone do something. So, if you have kids, probably, ¿qué les permiten que sus hijos hagan, right? Mm -hmm. uh, if you have dogs, if you have cats, if you have, o oh, si tienen personas a cargo, if you have uh, some subordinates, ¿Qué les permiten que hagan? What do you let them do? Or if we are talking about your friends, or if you're talking about the toxic, you know? <laughs> so what do you let them do, right? So vamos a escribir, we are going to make a couple of examples following this. Remember, necesito decir a quién. Uh, for example, I let my niece, mm -hmm. I'm sorry. No, my nephew, I'm going to change it. So I let my nephew, right, use my... Uh, 
shoes. Earphones. No, my shoes, no, because él es muy alto, no le quedan. But I let my nephew use my earphones from okay. time to time. Mm -hmm. So let this kind of allow, right? The, remember that the idea of let is allow. Yo le permito, yo lo dejo, right? Um, and help is exactamente eso, ayudar. So what do you help people do? What do you let people do with you, all right? Uh, guys, let's write a couple of examples, at least two, three examples with help and let, para que nos familiarizamos con la estructura and then we start practicing. So let's do it, guys. I'll give you like three or four minutes. I would say that is enough. Let and help, please. Guys, if you don't do this, let me know. Don't keep your doubts to yourself. Yo no para ensalada. Ah, bueno, tal vez con los huevitos. Y ensalada. Ah, dicho ensalada. Sí. Carlos is getting a keto diet. Sorry, Adolfo. You are you are taking a keto a keto diet salad with eggs. <laughs> 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 I don't see that I let, right. <laughs> let open the microphone. <laughs> but, but, but don't yeah. worry, I, I turn it off. I mean, because I, I noticed. So don't okay. worry. I'm sorry. <laughs> no worries, that's fine. That is the extra information we did. It. <laughs> no, no worries. Teacher. Hola, teacher. Yes, Rafa. Yes, yes, no, yes. No, no he entendido muy bien la idea del uso de LED. Oh, okay, okay, no worries. Um, so, lo que tenemos acá, what we have here is solamente la estructura. But, como en el ejemplo anterior, so the person was saying, oh, I let my customers do advertising. So, let is allowed, right? It's permitir. So when you want to say, yo permito que alguien haga algo, uh, so we use, mm -hmm. I allow you, or podemos utilizar, I let. Okay, guys, creo que eh, usamos un, unos, usamos casos, right? Eh, generales para todos. So let's talk about, creo que la mayoría está casado. I think that most of you have a couple. So let's talk about your couple. ¿Qué es lo que ustedes dejan? ¿O qué es que lo que su, su esposo, su esposa, su eh, fiance, etcétera, los deja hacer? <laughs> ok, in the sense of controlling, for example. So, uh, or if you have babies, let's talk about your family. ¿Qué es lo que ustedes dejan que sus hijos hagan? Or, the, eh, you know, the other way around. So, guys, me pueden dar un par de ejemplos con let. Let us permitir. So I let. Pero necesito a quién. I let my, no. my daughter watch TV late only uh -huh. on Friday. Ah, oh, very good. So I let my daughter watch TV uh, late, late at night. On Friday, you said. On Friday. 
Very nice. So on Fridays, we can say it on Friday. Exactly. Very good. Because the idea is that uh, during this day, Noemi permite que su hija lo haga. Only on that day. Very good structure and very good example. Um, I, let, I let my nephew drive my car. Oh, very good. Okay. Judy says, I let my children run and play inside in the house. Oh, okay. Okay. That's all right. And Angelica says, I let my sister use my jewelry. Oh, okay, nice. Y la ropa, Angelica? Ah, no, right? You mentioned that you don't, you don't no. let them because you're taller. Exactly, but uh, we, we use our blouses, blouses. Blouses. Oh, oh, you share blouses. Okay, you let them share blouses or they let you share blouses, okay. Um, I let my cat sleep in the sofa. Email that are you serious? No, the sofa, no. <laughs> yeah. I let my sister use my Netflix account. Oh, very good example. I let my sister use my Netflix account. Okay, cool. I let my son use my cell phone. Okay, hi, Iris. I help my son put on his shoes. Very good example. I let my son eat sweet. Oh, some candies. Okay. I let my nephew try my car. Oh, I like that. Okay. Exactly. So let, normalmente es que nosotros permitimos a alguien más, right? Pero no necesariamente tiene que ser con I. It can also be the opposite. For example, um, uh, ¿qué podemos decir si fuera al revés? No que yo permito, sino que mi sobrino me permite. So my nephew... Me permite que lo acompañe a jugar. Um, look at this. Ahora sí vamos a respetar terceras personas. My nephew lets me. Él me deja. So he lets me. Él me permite. Go with him. Go with him. To the soccer matches. To the soccer matches. Todavía me deja acompañarlo. You know? <laughs> so my nephew lets me go with him to the soccer matches. So yo lo puedo expresar. Oh, I'm sorry about the spelling here. I can express it whatever way I want, right? Solamente voy a respetar siempre el aspecto gramatical. I let my nephew use my computer. Very nice, Christian. Solo le quitamos el to, okay? I let my nephew use. That is perfect. My boss help, helps me with my tests. Very good job. Solo le agregamos S de tercera persona. Uh, Adolfo says, I help my okay. wife wash dishes. Okay. The doctor helps me with the therapy of my hand. Yes. Very good example. Is that a, an example or is that for real? It's for real. I what have is wrong a little with your injury hand? in my right hand. What happens? What happened to you? Uh, doctor says uh, uh, the problem is called uh, the dengatillo. I can't bend. I can't bend my finger. You can't bend. Yes. Like bend. I can't bend. Yes. Uh, oh. Make um, a serpuño. And how uh -huh. do I say a serpuño? Like put together? And I, I, I think uh, bend uh, uh -huh. my fingers. Uh, Which, all, all your fingers? No, uh, only one. Which one? Uh, the, I, I don't know, the second. <laughs> the index. Uh, the index finger. Yes, I oh. think, yes, I think. Wow, okay. Inter Does it hurt? Uh, sometimes. Okay, uh, yeah, because of the computer, it's uh, one of the fingers we use a lot, so, okay. But very good example, though. Um, <laughs> Judy says, my, uh, my husband lets me go out with my friends. Oh, Judy, what a very nice example. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so exactly, guys, ya no van a contar. <laughs> so we're going to tell us if that is for real or not. Uh, so again, uh, let es esta parte de permitir. En help es solamente help. Si ustedes le ayudan a alguien con las tareas, as I saw one example, 
I help my daughter, I help my son, I help my neighbor do the homework. Nos recordemos que no lleva el tú. Um, Rafa, es, no sé si, si a little clearer or not yet. Yes, teacher. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, nice. Kristen, very good. We let the users ask us when they have some trouble uh, with the system, okay? Or we let, I don't know, we let consumers, we let users contact us, right? Uh, contact us in case they have some difficulties. Mm -hmm. okay. So, okay, guys, very good. Let's come out with them with a couple of examples so we can share these ideas. Please, intentemos no escribirlas, intentemos ir ordenándolo de tal manera que nos recordemos. So, obviously, remember that siempre necesitamos un subject, right? And after that, I'm going to use let or I'm going to use help. And then I'm going to use who. Siempre necesito quién. Me, him, her, my boy, my girl, my, bro, uh, my, my brother, my sister. Siempre necesito. And then I need a bird. So we are going to follow this part. Okay. But we are going to try to... Um, so talk about your talk about your para no toda la escuela. Talk about your school times. Um, help, let, and pasado es el mismo, right? So let, but help, este se cambia, and the past is helped. So just be careful with that because we're gonna use them as well. Talk about your school times. Talk about, si es posible, right? If it is possible, talk about your family. So talk about, a little bit about eh, las actividades que ustedes ayudan en la casa. Who do you help? Or who do you let do something, right? So intentemos no escribirlas. Try not to write them anymore, but intenten ir ordenándolas de una sola vez. Um, so we can work on it a little eh, faster. Y trabajemos de una sola vez eh, pronunciación you know, entonación gramática sin escribirla please uh, guys I'm going to send you to some groups para que puedan compartir las ideas just share them and we come back in a couple of minutes so we have five minutes guys let's go only listen right but don't take notes please don't take notes
Okay, guys, thanks a lot for coming back. I was listening to a couple of examples with help and let, and very nice job. Is solo no se nos olvida, no va el to. So I let people know, I help people do, I help people complete, I help people cross the street. So, but we don't just, so just be careful with that little thingy. And the rest is like very nice. So here we have a couple of examples and exercises on how to use help and let. Um, so let me see. Kenya, what is it? Kenya, espero que mejore, miss. I hope you get better. So I read your text, but I'm sorry, I couldn't reply. Um, a quien no escuchado today? Uh, Delmi, ayúdame, please, Delmi. So help me, please. Uh, can you help us read esta parte de help? The chart with help. Help, help some, yes. Yes, help someone and. Uh, help some page four of infinity. Mm -hmm. He training helps a small business own, owners replicate the, mm -hmm. the success of big brands. The success of big brands. Very good. A marketing expert, expert could, could help you to understand the, the basic principles of branding. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Guys, um, so. Si se fijan acá, tenemos help you to understand, right? Y tenemos en la parte de arriba que es el base form of a bird o el infinitivo, que sería el to. But I got to be super honest, este no es muy común. So with help, it is not common to use to. Um, Christian, please help me with the second, with let. Okay. Uh, some companies let clients go through a service try before they decide to purchase mm -hmm. um, an effective brand lets people explore the benefit of their products okay very nice exactly good 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 and guys in the part below we have use the verse in parentheses to complete the sentences so we have think about how your business and we have help and we have satisfied. What do you think we can just in here? Think about how your business help or helps or help in past. I think help. Helps. Help. Helps. Help. Helps. Or help. Helps. 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 Mm, helps. Yeah. Very good because it's one business. So think about how your business helps your customers. And do we need to change more? Is, uh, we need to modify satisfy or not? No, uh -huh. the same. Satisfy. All right, the same. Mm -hmm. Think about how your business helps your customers satisfy their needs. That is the one. Number two, investors want, and we have let. Let's companies. Uh, do we need to change let or just let? Just let. Mm -hmm. Investors won't let companies. Uh, to, um, to or not to? To be or not to be? <laughs> <laughs> okay, vamos a cambiar to, el develop, guys, or not? To develop. Mm -hmm. So tenemos let, right? Con let, no oh. usamos to. Solo le quitamos el to and that would be the same. Investors won't let companies develop without a plan to without improve a business to improve brands. Brand. So it is safer not to use to here. Uh, number three, guys, ¿quién nos quiere ayudar con la tres? The pen. Helps and Become, uh -huh. become part of the brand. Very nice job, exactly. So the plan helps employees. Very nice, exactly. Number four, guys, who wants to help us with number four? Thank you. 
being specific about business brand, let's customers our products. No, no, no. Customers identify our products product easily. Okay. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Yes. Being specific about a business brand, let's, right? Very good. Thank you, Andrea. That was nice. And the last one, yes, tell me. Tell what me. is the pronunciation of, of e easily? The last word. Mm -hmm. yes. So, uh, solo divide, lo mis. Just divide it. Si se fija, la última palabra, eh, usted identifica el inicio. I think that you can identify sin el li, right? So, hasta acá, sin el li. How do you read it? ¿Cómo lo leemos? Easy. 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 Ahora, agregue el li. Easy. Easily. So, easily. Mm -hmm. Easily. Yeah. Li. So, okay. eh, um, siempre que vean una palabra con L y al final, eso le agregamos el mente de español, right? Easily, crazily, happily, suddenly. So, le agregamos el mente, felizmente, tristemente. Mm -hmm. So, that is the li. Lo vamos a ver later on. Yes. Okay. And, uh, and that would be it. Oh, and we have one more, right? So branding, guys, what, what about the last one? Branding, eh, let or let's? Let's. Let's. Let the customer. As. As. Ah, As. Exactly. No hay ningún cambio. Nice. So branding lets the customers add a perceived value to the product. Very nice. Okay. 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 Uh, we are not going to complete this one because uh, this is more related to writing. We are not going to work on writing today. But si hay un último ejercicio, guys, que vamos a hacer antes de eh, terminar la unidad número uh, three. And this is related to reading. So... Guys, take a look at this little reading that we have. It says, read the article about the importance of being first to create a memorable brand. First, guys, vamos a trabajar un poquito lectura comprensiva. Y vamos a hacer lo siguiente. El texto está largo. <laughs> vamos a aplicar técnicas de lectura. So, um, easy. Necesito que lea la primera oración. Uh, necesito que lean la primera oración y necesito que lean todo el último párrafo, ¿ok? Oh. So, no lo van a leer todo, you're not going to read everything, solo oración 1 hasta donde llega el punto, oración 2 hasta donde llega el punto y el último lo leemos todo, ¿all right? Guys, tienen un minuto para leerlo. You have a minute. No se detengan si no lo entienden, solo sigan leyendo, ¿all right? En, vamos a cronometrario porque sí necesito que apliquemos técnicas de lectura. And uh, it is going to be... Um, go. Ok. Three, two, one. Okay, guys, time's over. So, uh, question number one. ¿Qué entendieron? Eh, Netflix eh, marketing strategy. Uh -huh. uh, well, first, ¿leyeron todo o solamente leyeron que los pedacitos? Did you read just the pieces? I okay, read okay. only the pieces. Okay, okay. Uh, by, by reading we the sentences... We follow your indication. So, nice. So, by reading the sentences, ¿lograron tener una idea de qué se trata el texto? Um, about, about the, about the strategies, marketing strategies. 
Ah, okay. Okay. Netflix use to about Netflix. About mm. Netflix. Versus so not marketing master. strategies. Yeah. The people is uh, coming up to a uh, new ways, a new way service on on TV, for example. Ah, okay. So people is running away from Netflix, for example. Yeah. Do you remember anything that was in the text? Yeah, people want to know the news, for example, for example. Mm -hmm. What is new? What is new? For example, uh, now uh, nowadays Netflix is suffering mm -hmm. a I don't know a, a critical situation, right? Mm -hmm. Because okay. there are so many conditions to to join or to share the the Netflix platform mm -hmm. between families, for example. Oh, okay. Okay, very nice. Just by reading like two or three sentences, I think that we got like a lot of ideas. Very good job. So guys, lectura comprensiva is actually that. Si me detengo a intentar entender palabra por palabra, it is going to take forever. Y cuando lleguen a la segunda oración ya se les habrá olvidado. So normally when we read in English, the best recommendation is, si es un texto like this, lean el inicio, lean la primera y lean lo último. And you get the whole idea. So it is not necessary to understand every single thing. Uh, guys, tenemos una tarea for tomorrow and uh, esta sí la vamos a hacer de carácter individual because si quiero escucharlos, I want to listen to everybody like individually. La tarea es esta de acá, guys. The homework assignment is this one right here. Uh, it says what makes a brand memorable. Guys, todos recordamos alguna brand, like a very specific, for a very specific reason. Una brand puede ser like something Salvadorian, or if you say, for example, I prefer pizza rather than, um, what, Domino's or rather than Little Caesar, hay una razón, or there is something why that is memorable. Or the, um, what I want you to do for tomorrow, guys, is... Piensen, right, en la razón por la cual escojan una brand que les traiga memorias, I don't know, your childhood, your school days, or something, e intentemos describirla, and try to describe why it is memorable. So, mínimo de palabras, guys, son 100. En un minuto vamos a intentar decir 100 palabras, all right, describiendo why the brand is memorable. So, con 100 palabras no significa que les van a ir contando. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Pero sí nos da la idea que tenemos que escribirlo work. y practicar. Ajá, es como muchas palabras, mucha descripción. And, uh, obviously, uh, pueden leer un poquito de la, de la empresa, pero no se lo vayan a memorizar. No lo vayamos a leer. No se trata de eso. Si no, lean un poquito, probably, o intenten recordarse y nos cuentan de su experiencia, right? Cosa bien, guys, here no es como que tanto conocemos, sino es más co que nos cuenten what's going on in your head, right? So, this is the homework, guys. What makes a brand memorable? Y especialmente okay. si tienen una brand que es memorable for you. Yeah, kind of, pero no algo... Um, okay. Uh, like, out of context, sino más bien su experiencia. Like, in your experience. Something more personal, right? Porque una brand okay. ha sido memorable para ustedes. Guys, dudas, preguntas. Eh, creo que alguien mencionó al inicio de la clase que estaban teniendo dudas con eh, un ejercicio en particular. I don't know if el resto ya terminó la plataforma, guys. Creo que like two, three people. Sí, ya vi por ahí el, el reporte que está completo. Uh, ¿Alguien está teniendo dificultades? Are you good? Are you fine? No. Uh, I, I, I do um, with the um, um, uh, I don't know. No se preocupe. Eh, recuerde el ejercicio by any chance. Uh, the question about the four piece. Unidad dos. Yes. Okay. Um, you need to smart it. Yes, no me equivoco, es el primer ejercicio. Mm, ¿Qué tal está funcionando de este? 
Si no me equivoco, tendría que ser este. I think this would be the exercise. Let me share my screen. This one? Um, uh, yes, uh, the last one. Uh, okay, let me go all the way down. Uh, no, it's not. It's, it's, um... This is not the one. No. O, o de esta parte. Uh, de no, part. the five, the five question. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I mean, son las cuatro, pero están como en un orden específico. So ah, they okay, are like in a yeah. very specific order. Mm -hmm. No es product, eh, place, promotion y placement. Ah, sí. Give me just a moment. Hold on a second. Y ya les ayudo con el exercise. Let me just share my screen. Let me just share my screen. Let me just share my Ok, bueno, puede tenerla de varias formas, solo puede tener product con letra mayúscula, product, coma, price, coma, place, coma, and promotion. No se le olviden las comas, probable la uh -huh. forma que usted la tiene bien, pero si no hay una coma espacio, se la va a tomar incorrecta, right? Uh -huh. It is going to take it wrong, and creería que eso es todo. Oh, y agreguele un punto al fin, no, well. Pruebe con el punto final también. So you can try with a period at the end. Ok. Porque uh, es más formato. So sí son esas, pero es más formato, you know. So there are a couple of possibilities. Eh, guys, los demás estamos bien. Are we good? We got the answers. Eh, ya la completaron. Hay otro I, ejercicio que les esté dando problema. I only need to finish the final exam. In the final exam. Ah, okay, okay. That's okay. Ah, perfect, perfect. Super bien. Carlos? I have a problem with the same that Christian. Con esa misma. And I separate with comma every word. Y aún no funciona? No. Uh, the first letter is capitalized. Yeah. Uh, no. I read, I read place, eh, coma, como se dice, coma en inglés. Coma. <laughs> eh, place, coma. coma, space, promotion, coma, space, price, coma, space. Eh. Period. Period. Uy, permítame que me está cargando, and this is kind of slow. Uh, ¿Qué le pasa a Inter? Ya no quiere, no me quiere cargar. Wait. Uh, it's the point two. Les voy a compartir acá. Uh, let me write uh, that one. Tal vez puede ser solamente un error de... Creería que es formato, you know. No es que las tengan incorrectas. So let me share this with you. Y mm, copiela y so, pégala. So ya es copy and paste the, the final period. Mm. Lo que pasa es que um, hay, de varias formas se la va a tomar bien. Intente con esta y si no se la toma, quítele el punto, please. So eliminate the period. I Guys, care. acabo de tomar asistencia. I am ready to attendance. Eh, solamente me confirman, please, que esta ya les está funcionando. That is working fine. Oh, I, just no? can, I, just, I just share in the WhatsApp group. Yeah, oh, ok. Work. Sí, es que hay varias posibilidades que le va a tomar de mm -hmm. exercise, but You can try with this one. Okay. Um, si no le funciona, Kristen, quítale el punto. And otherwise, let us know. Let me also paste that one there. Okay, guys. Uh, so, thank you. Thank you, Judy. Oh, okay. And Judy, si le funciona. Okay, perfect, perfect. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys. So, let me know, please, tomorrow. Si hay otro ejercicio that is giving you some trouble. Gracias, guys, por conectarse y acompañarnos. Yeah, it works. Got willing, Thank perfect. You. Yes, nice, okay. nice. Sure. So it's got willing, people. I'll see you tomorrow. Dígame, Carlos. We never made a uh, one-to-one -one, uh, in, 
no one of the courses. The I group. have been, no, yes, I have been calling a couple of you and para las tareas extra. Guys, por cierto, me deben tareas ahora que lo menciona Carlos. Thank you so much for that. <laughs> so, um, no voy a mencionar nombres, pero ustedes saben. <laughs> Guys, envíenme los audios uh, that you owe me, please. And, uh, uh, but yes, let me just uh, call somebody here. Yeah, I have been like picking a couple of you guys. No worries, Carlos. Mm -hmm. Okay. So Perfect. thank you so much, guys. And Thanks I'll be you. seeing you tomorrow. Have good a night, everybody. Have a bye good bye. rest. Bye. Thank bye. you, teacher. I did it. Good I worked. Bye. Good work. Bye. Good night. Thank you. Good night.